All right, what's going on everybody? Broken Games HDR back at it again with another video. So this video is going to be a little bit different. In this video, I'm going to be talking about a product that you may be familiar with. If you're a gamer who likes to decorate and design their gaming setup, then you might be familiar with Nano Leafs. So I haven't done an unboxing video in a while and the people over at Nano Leaf, I contacted them and they were gracious enough and kind enough to send me a few Nano Leaf products for me to unbox and set up. As you may have noticed, in my background, I've been kind of, I've been trying to spruce it up a little bit lately. Cause you know, I'm kind of a bland person. I'm not like somebody who goes necessarily crazy with their gaming setup. My gaming setup in front of me looks great, but historically my background has looked very bland, dry, and you know, very uninspired. Cause I'm not that guy to like really go crazy with the lights and the decorations and the collectibles, but my wife, you know, and the viewers have been telling me I need to do something with my background. So I was, so I gave in and I'm like, fine, I'm going to do something. I'm not going to do nothing too crazy, but I'm going to do something, right? So I got a few, you know, you see the Funko Pops, you've seen my logo there before. And I was like, you know what, to top it off, I'm going to do a little bit of, you know, light work, right? So that's when I reached out to Nano Leaf. And as I said, they were kind enough to uh, send me a few products, which I'm going to unbox in a second so first of all let's talk about them right so let's see what they sent me so if you've looked up nano leafs before then you're probably familiar with the nano leaf panels which are the panels which are usually triangle triangular shaped i believe um they may have other shapes we're going to check on that in a minute but these are a little bit different these are the nano leaf lines. The nano leaf lines are pretty much, you know, what they <laughs> what it implies is it's just modular backlit smart light bars that connect together to create whatever different designs you want, right? So those are the nano leaf lines. And I'm going to switch over my screen in a second so we can uh check those out, right? But I'm just going to show you these and then unbox them in a second. So those are the nano leaf lines and they also sent me two expansion packs for the nano leaf lines if I wanted to do something a little bit more with them, right? And then the other two things they sent me were the nano leaf skins, which I'm going to explain what those are in a second, right? So Let's move over to my next screen. And then after that, I'm going to unbox these products. So as I said, you're probably most familiar with the Nano Leaf light panels, which as I said, um, these are light panels, which are usually triangular and you can, um, you know, create different designs with them and you could uh, change um, the color of them. You've probably seen these in a lot of people's gaming setups. They're very popular. So that's what the Nano Leaf light panels are. And by the way, any information you want on these, you can go to their website and check. I'll also include a link in the description for these. The next is what they sent me, were, which are the Nano Leaf lines. So these are what they look like. And as you can see, they're a bit different because they allow a little bit of... Uh, a little bit of a different and more obscure um, pattern and design free freedom versus the nano leaf um, panels, which are always going to be triangular. And as you can see, there are a few unique and and uh, different designs here. And then the nano leaf skins um, are just are simply just um, skins that change the outward appearance of the nano leaf lines because they are by default white. So if you look at the actual lines themselves, they are white. Of course you can change the, the backlit colors of these lines, but you may not want them to be, uh, for example, um, white. You may want it to be black. You may want it to be pink, whatever you feel maybe blends in or looks better with, with whatever backlit line that you choose. 
So now that I've explained that, let's get to unboxing um, these products. All right, so first we're gonna start with unboxing um, these Nano Leaf lines, right? Gonna unbox the, uh, the Nano Leaf line covers just so you can see what they are, but of course, this is the main, this is what it's all about. This is the main show right here, the Nano Leaf line, so. All right, here we go. We're gonna see what the presentation is like. We're just gonna flip that open. Okay. And all right, they got a, they got a little cover there. Take that out. A little quick start guide, little uh, smarter kit manual. Color outside the lines and on the back, on the back it shows you a few different designs that you know you could use just to give you a little bit of inspiration, give you a few ideas. And this is it. It's pretty simple. These are the nano leaf lines. You know, um, you can see uh, you know the lights on the back, the backlit, uh, they're backlit, and there's really not much to say about that, right? So those are the lines. You connect them, make the type of designs you want. Straightforward. Um, that's the power supply. When you first open up the box, um, not sure what all this, you know, you know, kind of not sure what all this stuff is. It may look a little complex. It's definitely not, right? They, there are the connector caps. There's nine light lines. There's the, there's nine mounting connectors, and then there's nine uh, connector caps. The connectors do what they imply. They just connect the different lines together, and then the caps. You just put the caps on top of the uh, connectors, um, and then there's the controller cap. Uh, which is the uh, the cap for the um, the main control piece because they're one of those uh, connectors. It has control buttons on there. You can obviously still cut, uh, control uh, the lines from your phone. You know, once you connect, uh, you know, the device and download the app. But there's also one control uh, connector if you want to do it manually by pressing a button. And they give you a you know a few stickies and you know mounting plates and tape also so check under there there's nothing there yeah that's really all there is to it you know simple packaging not too much flair straight to the point simple just how i like it okay so now the nano leaf lines which you're gonna see i didn't actually use but you know just unboxing it just so you can actually see you know what they are uh, the different color that they come in. Um, they sent me black. I think they also come in pink. And they also sent me, which I don't show here, they sent me some um, some more, so uh, some additional nano leaf lines. So I had a total of 15. So the design uh, you're gonna see is me using 15 nano leaf lines, but they actually only come, uh, the starter kit comes with nine, and the add-ons come with three each. So I had 15 each. And it's pretty cool that the designs that they uh, show you on the little pamphlet um, tells you, you know, how much nano leaf lines each dot each design would take uh, would take to make. So I think you can make some pretty cool, you know, designs with just nine. But you can definitely get a little bit more creative with a few pieces. So this is the setup with my cat was in the picture. And um, this is a video of when I had it on the floor before putting it on the wall. And then I'm just going to show you the music sync feature. All right, y'all. So I am back after setting the nano leaf lines up and I got to say it was pretty quick and easy. So I'm just going to give you a short review. So first of all, got it, got it up behind me, but as you can see with all the lights on, there's a little bit of a glare, right? So these are obviously better with the lights off and only kind of having like maybe one light source on. Um, so I'm just going to turn my ceiling lights off. and uh, move a little bit out the way. And as you can see, it looks pretty good. I did go with a pretty simplistic design um, cause you know, like I said, I'm not the greatest when it comes to art and creativity, but I think this looks 
really good. And obviously, if I want, I can change these up. I can switch it up to another design uh, if I want. So yeah, um, as far as the, the very short review, as far as I can tell, the build is of really good quality. You know, Nano Leaf products have a great reputation. Um, it was easy to set up. What they rec recommend is that you lay the pieces on the floor and uh, or on a flat surface and pretty much make the design that you uh, uh, want before you put it on the wall or on the ceiling or whatever surface you plan to pull it on, uh, put it on. And then you just use the connector caps um, and you just literally snap them on. They're just a hub and you snap them on um, to connect uh, your designs. Uh, then you use, there's one like central uh, control hub uh, and that connects to the power supply. So you want that part of the, uh, wherever you put the connector, the control part, um, you want that to be near where you're going to connect the power supply and where you're going to uh, plug in uh, these, uh, these nano leaf lines, right? And each, each uh, little connector, uh, connector cap has stickies on the back of them. And I haven't had any problems since I put it up. Nothing is like kind of falling off. They seem to be uh, pretty sticky, I guess, for lack of a better term. They're sticking to the wall, no problem. Um, they do recommend that you obviously clean your surface to get rid of any dust and to make sure the surface, uh, you know, is clean and no problems and everything will stick properly. And as far as the app, the app is very easy to use. Um, if I want, I could just change to other, you know, other colors. Some of the, you can make your own app also. Um, you can download some that people have, have already made. Some of these do look better, better than others. Uh, let me see what it looks like. I'm probably going to get pretty dark if I turn my ring light off. So yeah, it looks a little bit better with, with some lights off with some lights with one light source, as I said. Yeah, I do think some colors look a little bit better better uh, than others. I think some colors uh, present better than others, especially um, depending on your brightness. If you turn the brightness down a little bit, I think it also looks better. If you turn it all the way up, then it, it creates that little a little bit of a glare. So I think the, uh, the sweet spot is probably somewhere between 50 and 70%. Right there, that's like 55%. I guess I can, uh, you know, show you the app if this would focus a little bit. So that's all the app looks like. Um, you know, there's a bunch of different color designs there, and and there's a uh, where the hell is it? Where you can discover? Okay, right there at the at the bottom, there's a tab to discover, and uh, you could literally just download different ones to your device. The setup um, of connecting it to the app was pretty easy. You either need to put in a code to connect your device or you can, can connect to it by connecting um, the device and your phone uh, to your Wi-Fi connection or there's a QR code. There's a QR code on the power supply so you can also scan that and connect directly to the device. So there's, there's three different methods to connect the app um, to the device and they're pretty easy. Um, so yeah, I got really no complaints. I really like the device. Once again, shout out to Nanoleaf uh, for sending me this. I definitely ap appreciate it. Um, and I'm going to include, like I said, all the information you need in the description. I did look at like one two minute setup video because I'm more of a visual, visual person. The instructions in the manual were pretty clear. But once again, I like to see somebody do it rather than read. Um, they had some diagrams in there, but... Once again, I'd rather just see somebody do it rather than read. And uh, yeah, I'm happy. So I think, you know, once again, this is kind of middle minimalist because I don't like to do too much. As I said, I wanted something to like liven up my back area, but not go crazy with it. So once again, yeah, this is good enough for me. It's still, it, it looks nice, but it's still minimal. It's not too much going on. 
I like to keep things simple. So, but if you're somebody who is more creative than I am, then you could probably go crazy. Um, I probably will change this design up in the future, but for right now, I am very uh, content with it. And as you saw, as I showed in the uh, previous scene, it has a music sync feature, so you can play music and it will, uh, you know, react to that. So it's pretty cool. Great product. Thumbs up from me. I'm happy with my setup. So let me know what y'all think about this. Hit the like button. Let me know if y'all have any questions. And uh, I will catch y'all in the next video. Once again, shout out to Nano Leaf. Appreciate it. Peace.